Welcome to Illustrator. In this tutorial, we'll learn how to create a logo in Illustrator and I'll introduce you to key features of the program along the way. You'll learn how to deconstruct a reference image, such as a photo or a scan of a sketch, into simple shapes that you can use to design and create a successful logo. Our example is a logo for a pizzeria, so we'll use this photo of a pizza slice as inspiration for our logo. A logo identifies a business, so it needs to be simple, appropriate, and easily recognizable and memorable. It also needs to work across a variety of media and sizes. Illustrator creates vector graphics, which can be edited and resized without loss of quality and is the perfect tool for logo design. We'll get started with our own logo by creating a new document. Choose File, New. Change the name to Side Slice Pizza logo. Make sure print is chosen for the profile, set the units to inches, and change the orientation to landscape. Leave the rest of the settings at their defaults and click OK to open a new file. To save the design, choose File, Save. Save it on your hard drive. It should be named Side Slice Pizza Logo.ai. Make sure that the format or save as type is AI and click to save it. Then click OK. So that we all see the same thing, choose Essentials from the Workspace Switcher here, if it's not already selected. Then choose Reset Essentials from the same menu to reset all of the panels. Choose View, Fit Artboard and Window to make sure you can see the entire document area called an artboard. First, we're going to place an image to use as a reference for our pizza logo, so we'll place it in our document. If you want to recreate the logo shown in this tutorial, you can use the supplied assets or you can use your own image. Choose File, Place. Select the image and then click to place it. In the document, click over here to put the image on the artboard. With the selection tool selected, drag the image over here so it's out of the way and you can still see it. We only need to use this image as a reference, so we'll use the Layers panel to lock it in place. Open the Layers panel by choosing Window, Layers, or clicking the Layers panel icon over here. Layers are very useful in Illustrator because they allow you to separate content, change how artwork is stacked, make selecting easier, and a whole lot more. Double click directly on the Layer 1 layer name and name it Reference. That'll make it easier to identify our content later. Press Enter or Return. Click here to lock the layer and image so we don't accidentally move it. Now we'll create a new layer for the logo artwork we're about to create. Click the Create New Layer button down here to create a new empty layer above the original layer. Double click right on the layer name and name it Logo. Then press Enter or Return. Click on the layer name once just to make sure it's selected. That way, any artwork you create going forward is on that layer and is on top of the image layer. Choose File, Save to save the document. With the document set up, layers ready to go, and the file saved, you can start creating the pizzeria logo using shapes, color, and more. 